our first league game. It is against Evian. I know Evian used to be in League Uh a year ago, I think. And so I'm kind of scared because I feel like this could be a really difficult game. But I've made our squad and I feel like we might be able to pull out a win. We have Saudi up front, Sawadogo, and Hanu, and everything else is basically the same. Except for I changed out our goalie, who Janan, who is fit again, and we also have Aguno, who is in good form. You know, I think I just get a feel for this team. For some reason, we didn't have any friendlies, and I don't know why that is. Um, I guess they don't do friendlies in League Two, League Duh. Sadi! Oh my God, he's through! Oh man, and that was offsides. It'd be weird if you guys were blinds. Not not in a bad way, but I, I mean I'm not against blind people, but. If you were just listening to me, if you found this channel and decided that you were going to listen and not watch a channel that has less than 70 subs on YouTube and it's overall probably not going to be, be recommended by any of your friends. I mean, I'm not saying that blind people don't have any friends, but I don't think, because I feel like blind people have blind friends so there really isn't a market for my videos to blind people um so yeah good tackle from Kanongo and oh play him play Saudi cut it back smash it oh my goodness it has hit the bar and Colo is through holy crap Finesse it. Why are you not finessing it with your left foot? Do you think you can just do that with your right foot? No. Hanu with the cross. And it's a good one. And we gotta head to it. I'm not sure which one. And Kololo. We're going to have time, boys. Level no score yet. Well, there is a score. I mean, 0-0. Zero, zero, but no one scored yet. I don't know if I'm gonna make any changes because I feel like we're playing pretty solid. We're pl I know we're playing a good team. I can tell. I'm not gonna make any changes for now. If I feel like that we need a little fresher upper, then I will go ahead and do that. But I don't think that's necessary right now. This formation is working pretty well. Our defensive is solid and our possession is good, so it is really working in my opinion. Sawadogo, can we get a little bit of pace? Can we get a little bit of pace? A little bit of pace. Oh my god, he just totally ran through the defense. Oh my god, he just totally missed. Badly. Totally just got in behind easily right there. Most of it because of his pace. Actually, always of his pace. This game's all about pace. EA are losers. I knew Mike put it across like right now. Ooh, that's good. That was good. That was a good shot from Saudi. Not expecting to score there, but I'm glad he got that on target. Ah, uh, not good, not good. Good stuff from Saudi getting the ball back. We have Hanu on the left side. Let's see if we can combine at all. Oh, that is beautiful stuff. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh, Saudi's in. He's in. What a finish from Saudi. First goal of the season. First goal of the career mode, and that is a quality, quality goal. Totally fakes out the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper is not thing he's going that way. Because uh, Saudi has to have amazing balance for that. So that is a wonderful finish to go to the opposite side when you're at full sprint like that. First victory of the season from a wonderful finish from our main man striker. A really pleasant game too against a good, good team at home. Perfect way to start the season, in my opinion. We gotta know our players, know who's good, who's bad, who might be starting, who might not be, who might need to be rotated, who is definitely stuck on the starting 11. And our man of the match is Aguno, surprisingly, who got the goal assist and got an 8 rating, so that's nice. We have our next league game against Lens, who I believe was also relegated from League Uh last year and so it looks like we're getting pretty difficult fixtures up in our beginning stages of this career mode and i'm happy with that 
because we get them out of the way and then we can move on to the easier clubs. This is the squad we're going with. We have Saudi up front and Kololo bot right behind him. Both of them had good games. Then we have Hanu, Capel, Betch. Everything is the same pretty much except for Capel. I had to change him out for Agunon, who, mind you, got man of the match last game. But guess what? He has 34 stamina. I mean, that's so scary. I don't want him dying on the pitch. But I just don't want it to happen yet. I don't want our fans to be scarred for life. We are in the attacking zone, but I'm not really ready for that. I'm just not emotionally ready to attack right now. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to pass it all the way back. And we're going to go from here to Hanu. Hanu is doing very well. He did very well last game. Getting just away from his defenders. Can we get a good tackle on? Yes, we can. From Capel. Get back, Capel. Get behind the ball. Oh my goodness. Capel with another tackle. Not a whole lot of chances so far. I think there have been a couple shots, if if at all. And we're going to go into halftime scoreless once again. Sawadogo. I don't even think I can keep calling him that. It's just, it's just too long. I'm not being lazy or anything. It's just a lot of work on the tongue. And I don't know if I can handle it. So I might be calling him Dogo? Sawa. Should I just call him Dog? That's not. Ah, that's kind of racist. I'm not intending to be racist, but if that's taken out of context that I'm calling a black guy a dog, I mean, you don't call. Actually, you do. Randy Jackson did it. He called everyone dog. Black people can be called dog. But can a white person can? Probably not. Um, so I'm just gonna call him Dogo. Because I don't think people will be thinking of dog when I say that. Because I'll say like Dogo. Dogo. Dogo, Dogo, Dogo. Da. Yes. Alright, counter. Counter with Saudi. Oh, yes. Just sprint. Just sprint. Hey, sword. Hey, sword the fuck out of this guy. Come on. Oh, good stuff. I love it. Bang! Right at the goalie. Saudi with a wonderful play. Oh my goodness, Saudi. Come on. Oh my gosh! He just put it past the goalkeeper. And we're one up. And we have about three minutes left in the game. What a finish. I feel like the goalkeeper could have could have done better right there. But wow. We have won the game. Wonderful. Two goals in the career mode. Two victories in two games. We're pretty efficient, and it looks like one of our players has refused a contract, and it is our left midfielder, Hanu. I'm not enjoying that, because I like you, Hanu, and guess what? You're staying with me. I'm not selling you. For our next game against Nancy, we've made a couple changes. We have changed one of our center backs out for Martin, who has not made an appearance yet in the career mode. What's his name? Molin. We're giving him a chance in the starting 11. Nancy is looking really good so far. They're attacking. They're in the box right now, actually. And we need to get out of the box. Okay. Yeah. Oh! Saudi hits the bar. Put a tackle on Lupini. Come on. Ah. Uh, get behind him, Hanu. No, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Holy shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck! And that's halftime. They squeeze in a goal before halftime, and that's pretty disappointing. So we're gonna have to come back from that in the second half if we don't want to get eliminated from this tournament in the first stage. Oh, come on, come on, and call a low. Here he is in the box. Put something in. Make something happen, boys. Yes. Good interception. Can we make something happen here? Saudi! 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 Oh, that was a good tackle from the defender. But we are at square one again. We have to score. I'm losing here. Here we go. Switch it to Hanu. Hanu, break. Run. Run faster. Here's Molin. In the middle to Lololo. Can you get behind the defense? Please get behind the defense. Saudi! Saudi! Third goal for Saudi, the only player I've scored any goal with in this career mode, and 
Only it's the third goal I scored in this career mode. I would like to by Moulin's run. Get behind the defense, please. Oh my gosh, you did. Ah, you cannot put a shot in. Go on, Saudi. Finish it, Saudi! Damn, we could have won it with there. We are indeed going to extra time. Hanu, Hanu, Hanu. Get in the box, please. To Saudi. Saudi! Oh, wow. He almost scored. No, no way. Damn it. Easy for them. Easy stuff. I mean, come on, man. We have four defenders against one. So we're putting Rivas on the left, and we're putting Hanu in the center for Ancolo because Ancolo can't last much longer. I mean, he's really out of breath. And hopefully that can do something for us. Ah, oh, they're time wasting. Don't you dare. Don't you fucking dare, man. Sabadogo. With the cross! Oh! Rivas! Ah! No, 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 no. Go on, Rivas. Go on. Come on. Good stuff. Ooh, beautiful play. Holy crap. Damn it. Damn. Damn. Corner, corner, corner. Come on. Header. Ah. Oh. No. No. Don't blow the whistle. Don't blow the whistle. Come on. Give it to me. Give me the goal that I need. Fuck. Oh my gosh. It's a foul. On top of the box. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is the last chance of the game. Can I... I'm going for it. I'm going right there. That's where I'm going. I'm gonna fucking smash it! Damn it! Fuck! Fuck! Damn it! Ah! No, that did not work, and now we've lost the fucking game! Oh boy. This is the starting level we're going for for the next game. We have Capel at Cam, Dugomont at right wing, Konongo playing left mid, Pejuri, our other left back playing left back for us. And I don't I believe there aren't any other changes besides that. So we're gonna go ahead and sim this game. Skip. And Mulan has come up with a brace and that is enough for the win. So that's good news. Good news. We have quite a few final scrap reports, guys. And this guy is 66 rated and has decent stats. So he looks like he could be a potential signing. Um, this guy is 67 rated, which is nice. Bakayogo is 71 rated, and it would be very difficult to get him because he's just so expensive, it looks like. And this lad is 64 rated, not bad at all. 62, 66. Uh, Bakun is 71, but he is pretty old, and we can probably get him cheap. 70, that is kind of expensive. And then on the Belgian side, we have Final Sky reports on Dumeri and Gungaga, who is 68 rated, 67, 67, and 67, with more 69. And a little bit of 67. I can go out for days. It doesn't really matter what they're rated because I'm gonna buy one of them. I'm not gonna buy all of them, so I'm not gonna bore you guys on what these guys and how these guys are looking. I'm just gonna buy some of them and I'm gonna show you who I buy and I'm gonna show you the process of me buying them. And that's what I'm gonna do. And our next game is against Tours, and fortunately, we are in some good form finally. Tours, 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 Tours. A few years ago, Taurus had some really cool kits. You should look them up if you can. They're pretty fucking sick. They're like from FIFA 13 or something. And my friend and I would always pick Taurus because they have the meanest kits. And they also have really awesome uh, player names. 
For example, Vumbi Bundu, Kekiam Fongfong, Santa Maria, Burgundia, Kaku. I mean, how good does it get? Damn. That's pretty awesome. The game finishes as the tie, looks like, with Konongo uh, putting in the goal, but also getting a knock on the way. And that is going to be it for this episode of my new career mode series. Hope you guys are enjoying so far. And I would really appreciate it if you subscribed and if you liked it, if you did.